Hi everybody, welcome back. In this video, I will show you how do we use a rating gauge component to allow users to give the rating of the application that we have created. Let's look at it and see how the rating gauge component can be used in VB. So let me share my screen. So here, this is the application that we have on this shell page, right? On this cell page, we would like to create a gauge component here, which will allow user to give the rating of the application. So for that, what we will do here, um, after this toolbar, we will use our rating gauge component. And here you can see, we have the new components in the list, which is based on the core back. So we have the older also, we have the new early access. This is based on the core pack, which I'm going to use here, which starts with OJ-C, meaning core pack. If you go to the design mode, this is how it looks like. What you can do, you can also create a span here and provide a label for let's say text, let's say rate us rate us something like this right so you can say rate us right fine or you can remove that okay now what you want when user click also you can change the color of these stars from net neutral to called so this is how it will look like now so to save this rating we have created a rating business object where there's a one field called rating of number type where we will save the rating which is given by user let's see how this can be done so first of all i need to check if user has given the rating earlier or not if given then update the rating if user update the rating otherwise create the rating so for that what we are going to do, we are going to create one action chain initially. Let's say load rating and create. There, I am going to call a REST API, which will call my rating business object to get the rating of the logged in user. There, I will assign the queue and will say created by. So created by is one of the field in this business object and we'll check the user name. Okay, so I will put in the single course and we'll limit this record to one. Okay, so there I will create three variables also. Let's say rating of number type, rating ID of number type and let's say rated earlier. It would be of Boolean type. So this I will make as a false. Now go to the action chain and let's assign those variables from the result. If user has rated earlier, so let's make a if condition inside create error handler. And let's check the condition here. If the result is greater than zero, greater than zero, meaning user has given the rating, then I will use assign action to assign the data, the rating that I will save from this guy item and then rating okay i will use another assign variable to use rating id same thing i will do here also id and then another assign variable rating stated earlier and i will see true Okay, fine. Now let's go back to the shell 
and let's say assign this with the rating if user has given the rating it should show the rating here now on this i am going to update this on value event now here i will check if condition if rated given equals to true meaning user has given the rating earlier meaning i need to update sorry let's say call rest call rest here select rating let's say update patch so here what we will do we will pass the rating id that we have saved in the variable and in the body let's say rating and then this value okay and then save else call rest create branch else i need to create the rating for that user body rating let's say value and then save okay now let's say find notification here thank you so much for for rating and let's say confirmation so i can put it it on the top and i will not wait for everything to execute so i will put it here okay i will straight saying thanks let's run this application and see how it works now so as of now in the rating nothing is here no value is here so initially it will not show anything let's say for thank you so much for your rating and now if you go to your database it has been saved here which is four now when you load this application here you will see the four rating should be visible here what happened did i not include this hmm. why it is not showing i have done this rating then the issue would be let me check what is happening rating okay maybe oh, okay nothing is assigned here i guess something wrong mm, okay so i need to oh, okay so actually this action chain has not been called so i need to call this on vv enter now this will load i forget that you see for now you can update it thank you so much for your rating now if you go back to your tv you will see it is updated now let me delete it one more time just to show you refresh this page you see nothing let's give five then thank you so much for your rating refresh you see five let's refresh this and you will see the rating so this is how you can use rating gauge component to take user to take rating from the user about your work guys i hope you find this video useful thank you bye bye